Recently, you saw me reporting the Tesla model by electric bicycle e-bike uh, concept, which was painted by Kendall Turner, and it looks like there are lessons the bike industry should and should not take from the Tesla Model B e-bike. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here the first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news and ring the notification bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. Michelle Arthur Brennan has a very interesting story in Cycling Weekly discussing, discussing the concept of Tesla Model B e-bike and what lessons the bike industry should and not should and should not take from that e-bike concept. If there is one thing Brennan says that we can all agree on is that Tesla's Model B e-bike concept turns head. The machine is the brainchild of Kendall Turner and since it doesn't require physical input from the rider, we can comfortably disagree that bike is the most fitting title. However, this bike moped hybrid does carry some interesting learnings alongside a few technologies would rather live in the automotive world. Brennan says to begin the design process, Turner looked first at the detracting factors preventing people from cycling and then at the benefits of both driving and cycling. He concluded that the design of the uh, should offer the environmental benefits benefits of cycling, also combining the easy parking, low traffic and low cost with the ability to travel long distances, avoid physical effort, be relatively safe and enjoy the status symbol of the car. This was the um, uh, thinking beyond Tesla Model B e-bike that was uh, painted and presented by uh, Kendall Turner. Now, providing a low-cost status symbol appears to be a quandary in itself, but we'll roll with it. We can also assume that the bike is not pitched at the new and returning rider, specifically seeking out cycling for its benefits to health and fitness. The resultant concept of Tesla Model B e-bike offers the ability to ride on autopilot thanks to independent steering the bike handles itself. Forward, side and rear facing radars, cameras and ultrasonic sensors provide a 360 degree assessment of all that's going on around the bike. Then the fold out hand handlebars turn independently based upon a combination of force exerted by the rider and input from the sensors. This combined with dual driver hub motors in both the front and rear wheel which apply power accordingly allows the bike full autonomy to get the user out of harm's way or guide them effortlessly to their destination. Autonomous vehicles uh, aren't new. Self-driving cars have been making headlines for a while. However, in the case of cars, the driver's body has little input on the direction of travel, whilst even returning cyclists who haven't touched a handlebar since childhood might have trouble with the idea of an electric bike that unexpectedly swings left or right on itself. The other constant concern this rises, uh, the Tesla Model B e-bike concept rises, is that the independently powered fork shaft relies upon power to keep it going. Without input, it looks like the handlebars have mm, handlebars have uh, little use aside from providing a useful driving rack for socks once all the radiators in your house have been exhausted. They're not connected to the front wheel and therefore should you run out of juice you'll not be able to turn. A desire to avoid physical exertion also means that there is no pedaling involved and no drivetrain whatsoever. If you are un uh, unfortunate enough to run out of battery when riding a traditional e-bike, you can still turn the pedals to get home. Not so here with Tesla Model B e-bike. If you run this out of battery, it's akin to running out of fuel in your car. You're stranded and face a long walk to the nearest plug-in station should a compatible one exist outside of your home. So I think if Tesla takes the uh, Model B e-bike concept, Tesla needs to
to do something about this, has to come up with an alternative solution. Being a concept at this point, the Tesla Model B e-bike, of course, there is are design questions that might be answered should the bike go on the production by Tesla. And there are some positives here too. The three Stroud suspension wheels offer a newish take on road dampening and it's very similar to tech which has been effectively aiding wheelchairs uh, wheelchair users via soft wheel for some time, writes Brennan, saying it's not clear what tires the concept model by a uh, model B concept might run should it come to fruition but soft wheels are seen running schwabel rumber so that seems like a workable solution urban and road bike industries have long been looking for a method of offering suspension without the boeing effect that was seen on mountain bikes case in point of future shock from specialized in this trout system offers another design to the party albeit not a new one the integrated display providing navigation and customization is also a nice touch and is similarity to the sleek creators of silicon valley's highest profile output would not doubt offer familiarity and a magnetic draw to the bike that wired speedometers never could. The Tesla Model B concept also draws from seating tech we have seen elsewhere using what looks like a split nose saddle like those offered by ISM. These have divided opinion amongst hardened cyclists largely on an aesthetic basis but woven into the elegant carbon fiber construction the blood flow allowing perch fits in just fine however with uh, its step downward tilt the tesla model b rider may not be actually sitting on the saddler for long the designer appears not have followed the lead of traditional bike and motorcycle saddles which are generally level with the exception of motor gp bikes which have a fuel tank to prevent the rider sliding forward Concept bikes are concepts for a reason. Not every element would make it to the drawing board where the production to be over the product to be created for consumption. However, being free from the constraints of production allows for a little more freedom of imagination, which can breed inspiration when you are uh, doing a concept bike or even a concept car. So if we were Tesla, uh, uh, which the author says we're not, we would drop the autonomous steering, maybe hook uh, the sensors up to provide warnings on that very nice display, allowing the rider to react themselves and fit some pedals the suspension and split nose saddles can stay friends let me know what you think do you think tesla will bring this concept model b electric bike to fruition and production and if yes what should tesla ch change and what should tesla pre present uh, if you are a bicycle if you're a cycler that will be interesting to hear your opinion as well in the meantime this is armin harian from torquenews.com please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla and electric vehicle news and ring the bell so you don't miss my next tesla story have a blessed day god bless you everyone and peace be with all of you